Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well today. I wanna to bring you a concerning case of a missing teenager. Um, I believe I have her on the page for you already. So this is her picture. Um, there's actually a couple of photos of her. Her name is Emily. And um, uh, I'm not even sure how to say the, the county to be honest with you. Um, but uh, help help us find a missing juvenile. Have you seen this missing juvenile, Emily Hain, I believe is how you would say her last name. Emily was last seen Saturday evening at 10 p.m. on Sawmill Flat Road wearing gray sweatpants, a light colored top, and black and red Nike tennis shoes. Emily is 16 years old, 5 foot 7, and approximately 120 pounds. Anyone who has seen or heard from Emily or knows of Emily's whereabouts is encouraged to contact Detective Reese at 209-533-5815. And I will show you her photos one by one here. And I'm going to be um, reading a post from some of her family. And uh, I also have a video that I want to show you that is, it's, this is just, it's concerning. It is, it's got me worried. It really, really does. She is very cute. She's a very cute girl. Right, so those are some photos. Now, I'm going to give you the story here. Let me bring you over to the post by her sister. And once you start to hear this, you might kind of understand um, a little bit. So my 16 year old sister has been missing since 8 p.m. Sunday night and is now reported as missing to the police. She was to be picked up by a local young man who says that he never saw her but she told several people he was coming to pick her up and is shown on the ring camera picking her up. Please share. Her name is Emily Hain. She left in a small silver car from Columbia slash Sonora and took no backpack, etc. Message her mother, Lisa, or call the whatever that county is, sheriff. Um, they are looking for her. The phone was last pinged in San and Andres Monday at 5 a.m. San Andres. Um, here's some more photos, though. Um, if that doesn't concern you, I mean, I don't know what, what. If she didn't take a backpack, it's not like she was intending to run away. And if she was intending to run away, why would she have told people that he was going to be picking her up to begin with? She just wouldn't have even mentioned it. Very, very concerning. Yep, I'm, I'm a bit worried about this one. I really hope that everything's okay. I, I'm, I'm a bit worried. Um, and then I'm going to take you over to her grandmother. So let me bring you over there real quick. And then after that, I'm going to show you this video. All right. So Debbie. <clears throat> All right. My 16 year old granddaughter has been missing since 8 p.m. Sunday night and is now reported as missing to the police. She was to be picked up by a local young man claiming that he was 19 that he is actually 24, who says that he never saw her, but she told several people he was coming to pick her up and is shown on the ring camera picking her up. Please share. Her name is Emily. And um, she left in a small silver car. Same information, right? So, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So here's um, another photo. Actually, I think, um, let me check really quick. I think there was more on the sisters. Let me um, just check that really quickly because I think that there was more I wanted to read to you 
from the sister's profile. Um, I know that she definitely had a lot that was from the sheriff office. Um, okay, so this one actually reads that, and did I just say 24, right? Because uh, this one claims, um, he claimed that he was 19, but he's actually 23, right? It says that he never saw her, but she told several people that he was coming to pick her up. And it's shown on the ring camera. And that's what I'm going to show you. There's actually um, additional photos over here as well. And there's a slight variation in height as well. So from 5'7", um, uh, some measurements over here say 5'8". So it's only an inch difference, but it is a slight difference. It is a slight difference. Um, let me check if there was um, any other details in here that I would like to let you know um, that's not not already stated on here. Um, I feel like there was some other information that I read and I'm not, um, it might've actually been by the mother. So let me, let me take you over to that. And, and like I said, remember she was wearing, um, gray sweatpants, light colored top, black and red Nike tennis shoes. Okay, let me bring you over to this video. And you're gonna see what I'm talking about here. This will give us a little bit of an insight on this vehicle. All right, so, um, it just says, my daughter went, yeah, okay, this is what I want to read to you. My daughter went on a third date with a guy in this vehicle and has not been seen or heard from since. If you recognize this car, please message me. Okay, so it's somebody that she had gone on a date with prior. That is why she had told people she was getting picked up by him going on another date. She wasn't running away with him. She was just simply going to go on another date with this guy. Didn't take a backpack with her. Didn't take extra belongings with her. But let me show you this video. I want to make it here. Please turn around in the driveway. Please don't back out. Oh. It's silver. It's silver gray. There it is. Wow. Look at the top right here. That says 10, 16, 2022. This is the night. This is not just any night that he came and got her. This is the night he said he did not come and get her. And he did. He did come and get her. He lied. Why? Why would you lie about that? Why would you say you did not come and get her? But you did. The, the, what reasoning? What do you have to hide? I'll show you guys one more time. I'll turn the volume off just that way it's not um, blasting us in the ears anymore. Um, so the volume's off, but it is playing. So I'll show you guys one more time what the silver car looks like.
So that would be 7.04 p.m. If I'm doing my, my math correctly, I think. Wow. Oh, I hope she's okay. I really, really hope she's okay. You guys, I'm going to be making a community post about this as well. Um, please, please share this out. Please, please share the community post. Um, get the word out about this case. And let's try to get her found. Let's try to get uh, some answers out of this man. Um, because, again, here we go with somebody lying and saying that they're you know, I'm not much older, you know, no, I'm just 19. I'm just only 19. Like, you know, so I'm old enough to probably what have a place of his own and have uh, be able to drive, right? So I'm older, but not saying that he's actually uh, 23 or 24 years old. Wow. Not good. Not good. I don't like this at all. Um, everyone, I'm going to put you back on one more photo of her just to show you again. Um, here, I'll put you on these photos and show you what she looks like again. And like I said, I'll put up the community post so that you guys will have access to some of the pictures as well that way. So there's some of her pictures, but please share it out, you guys. I will keep you posted on this and updated as I end up hearing anything else about it. Um, I'll keep the updates coming. I hope that you all have a good day. I will talk to you all very, very soon. Take care, you guys.